All right, you all know what happens when I play Guardians, but what happens? What happens when I play something a little stronger? Something a little top tier, all right? Ho-Yi, I used to be a Ho-Yi main when he came out, all right? But then they overbuffed him and I didn't like playing him as much. I still played him, but I stopped playing him around season three-ish. But I do have four stars on him. Uh, Yeah, what they ended up doing, what I didn't like, was they lowered the cooldown on his one by four seconds. And he became a god where if you miss your one, you are punished hard for it to a god that, oh, this is just broken for everything. So, yeah. But I figured we have a lot of guardians on the channel. I've been uploading a lot of guardians. But kind of want to give you guys a little taste of what happens when we play something really, really good. Because I almost never do. Uh, what I used to do on Hoi to, to just flex is I would go instant cast. Because I, I just knew all the bounces by heart at one point. But... I don't think I can do that anymore. Maybe one day I'll do an instant cast challenge. Uh, I, I do it on stream sometimes, very rarely, but that's it's always fun to get bounces in your instant cast because you're not even you're not even using the targeter, you know. It just it's just fun as well. He's standing in a scary place for himself. Nope, almost did it a little bit too sharp. He went breastplate first item, uh, as well as uh, bracer. I do miss that uh, the bounces don't give ex additional damage for creeps anymore. That used to be the case, but I mean, Ho used busted, so any nerf that came to him, I was kind of happy about. <laughs> you know, they removed the penetration us too and all that stuff. But it's all, it's all fair. It's all for good reason. What the hell? All right, oh, he's so broken. I didn't even hit him and I killed him. The, <laughs> the ricochet just disappeared. All right. I always, whenever I'm playing a god like Hoi, I will 100% say if it's skill or if it's uh, luck. That was luck, okay? That was luck. I didn't, I expected to hit him maybe twice. Oh, whoops, I messed up the triple bounce. Awkward. But uh, for him to die to an invisible shot was not expecting that. Uh, maybe. I am wearing a hat in this skin. Yeah, so... I don't... I don't even know what bounce could have happened. All I know is that the third bounce went invisible and killed him. So that's some... That's some BS. I'm sorry, Vimana. One reason I don't like playing OP gods very often is because it makes me feel disgusting. Especially when unfair stuff like that happens. Don't get me wrong, it's kind of funny, but it's also super unfair. On the other side of the coin, though, I have died to invisible ricochets more times than I can count. So, you know. Oh, thank you. What a nice lad. I'm sorry that I played Ho Yi against you. I just want to show the people that I can play good gods too. I could probably ult him. His, his ultimate's not that good because I have a uh, anti-heal. There's a bounce right here that could kill him. Oh, needed to do it a little bit to the right. Oh, now that one, I fired it before I was in range because you can still fire it while moving. I thought I'd be in range of the bounce by the time I got there, right? But it started to bounce. The animation started to bounce. And then all of a sudden... Oh my god. Uh, awkward, awkward, awkward. I'm out. I'm out of here. Dang, I didn't think that he was going to stay. But uh, if you look at that ricochet, it started bouncing and then it just disappeared. So something's happening with our bounces. And I don't know how to feel about it. Something funky's happening. I like this skin. Uh, my favorite Hoi skin is probably this one. However, my second favorite one is Iron Crow because that one's actually kind of rare now. It used to be that everybody had that skin because it was like the first battle pass or the first season ticket as it used to be called. And now not that many people have it. So it's cool. It's cool. Yeah, uh, Hoi is not even my specialty in terms of OP gods anymore. It's more on her. On her is the god that I... I play when I try, when I'm tryharding, which I don't do very often. 
but I just thought to pull out the Ho Yi just for for old time's sakes because Ho Yi used to be Ho Yi my Ho Yi montage was the first montage I ever released. It's still on the channel. You can go look at it. It's hilarious because it's so, kind of bad. Oh, hold on. We need to be careful. Got him. He is going to get red buff. That is fine. I am fa fine with that. I wonder if it's possible to go a pure power build with, with Hoi with like Heart Seeker and everything and just only kill with bounces. I mean, they... they the scale is really hard. Really hard. Yeah, one thing I hate about Hoi though is that you can win with Hoi without hitting a single bounce. Like if they removed his bounce mechanic, he would still be a top tier in duel. Cause uh most you don't even need to use it. Because his base damage is already so high on it. Whoops, I actually tilted my mouse a little bit. Which is fine. Hold on. He does have red buff, so we gotta be sneaky. Surprised he's not ulti. Probably because he knows I have the curse honk. Do I hit him? I don't know if it's worth it or not with my curse honk applied. Probably not. Oh, I walked into it! Oh my god! <laughs> well, that was stupid of me. I literally walked into it. Well, you know, playing an OP god makes me worse. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we are against Vamata. Vamata's good against most physical gods, but I mean, we should win this either way because we are Hoi. Oh, that's funny. Is he taking my buff? Dude. Oh, no, no, no. Nah, uh, uh. Oh, I could have maybe ricocheted him there. I could just leap on him. Nah, well, I'll die to minions. Hmm. I knew he would move. I was considering going for this shot behind the tower, but he wouldn't have moved into it enough. Unlucky. Could have probably gotten for one of these though. One of these would have been good. You got Charles too? He already has the me and I'm taking 35 shots a pop. Let's go back. Gotta go back. Now we have some defense of our own. So we'll be actually be able to deal with him a little bit. Yeah, if you guys want to see certain gods, uh, go ahead and comment them and I'll, I'll consider playing them. I think that right now, just on YouTube, I've just been playing a lot of gods that I either, they're either my specialty or that I just have fun with. Or something I haven't shown on the channel before, which right now is Ho Ho Yi. Oh, there's a lot of good bounces there, and I didn't go for any of them. Nice. That's an easy bounce, though. I haven't gotten any cool bounces by skill, only by luck so far. <clears throat> it's probably because I haven't played Ho Yi in like months. It's all just natural, I guess. Just because I used to play him so much. He's my second most worshipper god, and I... It's so weird, because I, I honestly don't remember playing him that more, that much. Like, I swear I've played Fafnir more than him, but nope. My Fafnir's about to overtake it, though. My Fafnir's at, like, what? 3,500 worshippers? It just needs, like, 2,000 more. I'm dead. Oh. Oh, are you going Frostbound? All right, so we have some options. We can go Breastplate. We can go Nemean. Nemean's not that good against uh, Vamana because if Vamana hits you in his ultimate, then he will take damage. And whenever he takes damage, his ultimate is 
the duration is increased, so not that good. The breastplate, yeah. Contagion also, but eh, don't need it. And I think I'll go... Actually, I'll go upgrade Sunder just for his ultimate. We'll pop both of them and then just shred him. Uh, this Frostbound's going to be annoying, but as we get more attack speed, it should be fine. Oh, he got Bull Demon. All right. Yeah, the, the couple OP gods I don't like playing at all because I suck at them are Uller and Hebo. And the reason is I just don't have that much practice in them. And what happens is if I let them through is then I get a mirror match. And who's going to win? A Uller that plays Uller all the time, every time that Uller is open. Okay. Just barely. Now that one was skill. That one I knew it would double and maybe triple bounce if I was lucky, but I was able to get it. Nice. Um, what, what was I saying? I was saying something about... Oh, but if I play an Uller mirror, and I'm against a Uller that plays Uller every single day of his life whenever Uller's open in rank duel, I'm not going to be able to beat him. I'm just not. It's as simple as that. Uh, the same thing with Hebo, unless I pick, like, Bender. I beat in Hebo with Ymir once. I wish I recorded it for YouTube. Oh, I kind of missed one auto, but it wasn't even that bad. And oh, just barely. Should have used a Chris Donk first. If that Sunder was upgraded, would have gotten the kill. Also, fun thing against Vamana. Executioner is really good against him. Not as much as Titan's Bane for the reason that lowering his physical protections lowers his power because of his passive. Not by much. But it's just kind of fun to think about. I mean, if he goes a ton of defense, Titan's Bane is better. But Excuser, you know, lowering his physical defense so you have more power. So he has less power. Always a good thing. Just took red buffs, so let's go take some other buffs. Also, I know you guys comment that I, I'm bad at using my potions. It's something I'm working on. I apologize if it's frustrating for you guys to watch and... My potion use is bad. It's just, if I'm commentating about the game, about what's on my mind and little tips and stuff, I just get distracted. I don't claim to be the best dual player or anything like that. But I do think I have some good insights to the game mode because, whoops, didn't mean to that. Because I do have so many games in dual. I have like 9,000 games. It's an okay ult, because we just uh, locked off his escape route. Really? Really? I only got a double bounce off that? That's unfortunate. Those walls, nah, nah I just... Ah, I should be able to get a triple bounce, that's on me. We're gonna need a Toxic Blade, because he is still healing in his ult quite a bit. I mean, obviously, if I don't have Curse Donk, I'm not anti-healing him. 99% of the time when I'm against Vamana, I don't attack him at all in his ult. I'm just... I'm overestimating Koei's damage a little bit. I'm overestimating it by quite a bit. So, like, when I should not be fighting him, I'm fighting him because I'm like, Oh, I'm OE, I can just kill him. Which, I mean, it's not necessarily false. It's just closer than I expect. And I'm bad. Can I get this ricochet, please? That's fine. I mean, I'm winning fights. That's what, that's what matters, right? I just need to go take more farm. We have Void, so he can't sneak a Bull Demon. Looks like he's going Void. If I decide to go double defense, I will go Void as well. I haven't decided yet.
All right, let's go. Let's go. I like having fun with whatever god I play. Hence the... These are not ideal relics. I mean, the Cursed Donk is, but the Sunder is not. I can see him because of... His aura. Oh, smart. Smart. If I hit my triple bounce there, I would have killed him. So I kind of aimed it the other way. And I was dead out of the way because he has Frostbound for lockdown. This isn't going that well. The Nemean Frostbound, tier two void, shutting me down. All I really have to do is get this Toxiblade online. With Toxiblade online, we good, we good. I honestly, I don't know what would have been better, showing a matchup where Hoi dominates or showing a closer match. Cause then it's like, cause then it's actually a closer match. So this is a closer, closer match. Showing a matchup where Hoi just one shots isn't very good now, is it? So hey, maybe this is better. Oh, he took Bold Demon after all. If I went straight over there, I could have maybe stopped him. I thought he was just going to go check minis and then back. Just need 600 more gold. 600 more gold. Actually, a little bit under that. How much health do you have? Chin size might destroy you. Yeah. I think a chin size will. Life still would be nice as well. Just to heal up from the man. Got half his health. But he got a quarter of my health just just with the man. Which is kind of crazy. Nice. If he ulted there, he probably would have lived because I wouldn't have had a chance to pop Curse Donk for a little bit, like until I hit the ground. And by then, he would have gotten a big enough shield and health to live. I'm almost certain of it. Looks like we can take Phoenix, maybe? Or just half of Phoenix. I mean, our next minion wave is here. So we should be able to take it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, minion wave. Need to move faster. I can't wait until the bug is fixed with Emoja, by the way. Once the bug is fixed with Emoja, where her Omi works, uh, she doesn't lose it whenever she dies. I'm gonna be playing her so much. All right. It's hard to get nice shots on Vamana as well because he is so tanky. If he hits me right now, I'm dead. Okay, we good. Nice. Looks like he's going... What is that going to be? Mid-Guardian? Looks like it's going to be Mid-Guardian. With that much defense, I almost rarely do this, but we're, I think we, we're going to need Titan's Bane Executioner. Also, let's upgrade this. That is just way too much defense, you know? Uh, chin size, you know, obviously I want that, but I think I'll have to wait until after Boots. Executioner and Titan's Bane. Now, the way they work is they fight because the Order of Penetration is per... What is it? It's percent reduction, flat reduction, percent pen, and then regular pen. So, percent reduction is Executioner. Flat pen is like Void Shield or Stone Cutting. And percent pen is Titan's Bane. And then regular pen is, well, just the stat. Nice. Nice. I had a lot of increased damage there. A lot of increased damage. It took 423 damage from just me and GG. I mean, yeah. Yeah, that's how ye. Makes me feel scummy every time, especially with that first blood, because it was an invisible bounce. I don't know if it was invisible on his screen or not. I might ask. <clears throat> Let's show the stats. Hey, for first blood. For blood. Was the bounce invisible? Man, why can I not type right now? What's the damage mitigated? Damage mitigated? 30,000 from him. Mitigated three times as much as me. Wow. Okay, I don't know if he's going to reply. Either way, thank you guys for watching. 
Uh, again, I'm trying to upload while I'm on break, so I've recorded all these games ahead of time. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.